What's up everybody? My name is Ryan and I'm an emergency room nurse in the US military and I'm also a real estate investor. I've been doing this for the last two to three years and I recently just got back from deployment uh, yesterday actually. Uh, I got back on the island. Um, I did two weeks of quarantine back in Texas and now I'm here for my next 14 days of quarantine. I'll be at my house uh, the whole time and on the way over here I decided I was going to do a at-home blog to kind of show you guys or explain my real estate rental property portfolio and uh, my journey to where I am today and kind of my goals to going forward and what you guys can do to you know get there or hop on the train and um, get to financial freedom which we're all aiming for at some point in our lives um, on the way over here I, I wrote down kind of a schedule what we can do and what uh, I plan to do for for each day of this quarantine so on day one is pretty much an introduction and uh, tell you a little bit about myself um, and that's pretty much it. It's what I'm doing kind of right now and we'll go over the next next few days um, property wise I got two I got one in Massachusetts and I got one in Hawaii both I um, the Hawaii house I'm house hacking right now and the one uh, back in Mass I've had the same renters for the last uh, 12 years I just took over the property um, which is very exciting and just trying to you know build this portfolio and hopefully get to a thousand units and uh, we'll go over goals another day but um but yeah very exciting stuff and i'm happy to share it with you so day two is going to be finance or future fridays um each day has like a little slogan or whatever so stop hating but uh, a group i'm a part of active duty passive income uh, they have a financial freedom number uh, or a freedom number and basically uh, they're breaking down that your finances what it would take uh, what's the number it would take for us to be financially financially free and to live out you know however we want to live for the rest of our lives and we'll go over those finances tomorrow and show you how to do it yourself and then how do we get there using real estate or real estate deals uh, day three I uh, called Smart Saturdays. Uh, so we'll go over what a smart goal is, how to create them, how to do a dream board, and um, yeah, how do we correlate it to both military professional goals and real estate investing goals. So, uh, summary Sundays. So when I was on deployment, I was a flight nurse and uh, attached to a medevac unit. Had a whole lot of fun, uh, but there was some downtime. You know, not everyone was getting hurt, which was uh, which was great. And had some downtime, read a whole lot of rental rental property, real estate books, uh, both through Bigger Pockets and some of the books that they were recommending and ADPI that they were recommending and downloaded them on my little iPhone and, and read a bunch. And with Summary Sundays, I plan to take a, an important topic or uh, a poor chapter and pretty much review it, talk about it a little bit, uh, show you my my thoughts on it, and you guys can comment, you know, on on the video, and um, we can kind of create a little dialogue there. And um, if you guys want to learn more about it, then feel free to, you know, you can download the video um, on Amazon or you know wherever you can find the book that I'm talking about. Um, so yeah, that'll be a little fun. Five, uh, day five would be uh, Monday, so Motivation Mondays. <laughs> I also talked about Mentor Monday or Monday Meetup. Um, so basically, on that specific day, uh, we'll talk about kind of what's what's motivating us in real estate and pretty much things we do to make sure we're on the right track um, each each and every day. Day six, Talking Tuesdays. Um, here, I kind of created a goal to talk to talk on the phone with one person in the real estate business. Um, whether it's a bank, agent, uh, lawyer, whoever, and tell them what I do, what, I, what I'm looking for, and do that only for one person every Tuesday for 12 months. Now, granted, at, at the end of 12 months, that'll be about 48 people. The premise behind it, you are networking, and you're kind of stepping out your comfort zone. You're not in a big group where you're introducing yourselves to, like, you know, 50-something people, and you might not remember any of those names this one you're in the comfort of your own home you know you're looking up people in your area you know whether it be a property management company or an agent and you know, pick them up call and uh just kind of go for it ask them some detailed questions and we'll go over all that um in a little bit but that's the plan for tuesday uh wednesday why wednesday uh, pretty much 
explore the why. Why are we doing this? Why are we trying to get to financial freedom? And why is it so important for, for myself, my family, uh, moving forward? So, day eight, Thursday tips or tenant Thursday. Um, basically give you some ideas, uh, things that I do to maintain a relationship with uh, my tenant um, as a, uh, a good landlord uh, should be doing. Um, you're not trying to be, you know, crazy friends or um, get too involved with your tenants, but you're you're doing everything you can to make sure you're doing the best possible job, you know, as a landlord, and that is our kind of duty as a landlord. Um, so we don't get that slumlord um, connotation, which is which is terrible. Um, so yeah, we'll do that on Thursdays. And day nine. Uh, We'll be talking about uh, Rent with Ryan, my business that I created while I was overseas and finished up uh, as soon as I got back here. Uh, how I did that, uh, what websites uh, I created, emails, things like that, um, the costs around that, and the importance of it. Day 10, some of the software involved in rental properties. Day 11, we'll be right back to you know those same type of days. Uh, Sunday, Sunday summary, right? Uh, back to Motivation Monday that following Tuesday, we'll, we'll make another phone call. And day 14, uh, again, reviewing why we're doing it. Uh, at the end of those 14 days, hopefully we can uh, keep the ball rolling. We'll see uh, some of the feedback I get from this. And I look forward to working with all you guys and um, talking shop with real estate and anything you guys want to talk about. And, yeah, looking forward to it. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.